our body can hold one teaspoon of sugar, right, in our whole entire bloodstream. So if we go out and we drink a Mountain Dew and a Coke and like that, what do we do with all that extra sugar, right? You call insulin. Insulin comes to get the sugar out of the bloodstream. Where do you put it, right? Where would you put the sugar first? If you were designing, where would you put the sugar first? Uh, in my muscle? Yeah, glycogen stores, right? But you haven't worked out today. You've already eaten six times. They're your glycogen off. stores are topped off. Now what? It goes in your liver. So now we have fatty liver disease, which is killing a lot of people. That leads to the insulin resistance. This leads to the problem we're talking about. This is why it's so important, right? Because we're, we're avoiding fat because we're afraid of fat, and all our sugar is being stored as fat around our liver and organs and all the worst areas. And now we have insulin resistance, we have metabolic syndrome, we have all these problems. We all know through our medical studies is that people with central obesity, meaning the guy with a fat belly, skinny arms and legs, is at a huge risk, way more than this 450 pound guy, believe it or not, because he's distributing his fat normally where it should be, all through his body. When you strip it all in the middle and you have this big hard gut and they go, oh, look, I don't have any fat, look, it's, you know, it's hard, that's bad. That means you're at a severe risk, right? Yeah, you have fat stored around your lip, you have the visceral fat, which is extremely dangerous. Mm -hmm. 